Hello, folks. I'm Dan Stevens. Welcome to the Stardome. By my side, Mr. Peter O'Keefe. Peter, we've got a heck of a showdown coming up today. On one side, a running back who's capable of single-handedly taking over a game. And on the other side, an inside linebacker with a pension for crushing hits and stuffing the run. No doubt about it, Dan. This pass will fall. Our receivers line up as the defense settles into a nickel package. Williams dodges this one way out right and... Number 17 catches the heater left sideline and is at the 25. Five. Brought down hard at the one. It'll be first and goal. Or air threat here. Let's see what they do, Dan. Williams gets the handoff and gets the touchdown. Number 31 grabs the fast. Sanders pitches it in the flat and gets... Watts makes a play. Number 15 throws a bullet and their last drive stall out at the end. We'll see if they can keep momentum throughout this one, which starts at their 47-yard line. Number 30. Number 10 gets all of his arm into this pass and... Number 85 makes the nice catch. And... Number 10 passes this one after the play action. Number 9 from 28 yards out and it's good. Number 97 and long ahead. Look at those career stats. That's a nose for the ball, my friend. Number field, and they have been having a very tough time passing the ball. They have another opportunity here as they start off at their own 18-yard line. Number 10 lets it go here, and it's knocked away. It looks like, uh, yeah, we've had an injury down on the field. As soon as we hear anything, we'll be sure to pass the information along to you. Robinson grabs the bullet. Oh. Number 87 goes in motion. Williams gets the toss and takes it upfield. Eventually tackled at the 37. It will be first down. It looks like, uh, yeah, we've had an injury down on the field. As soon as we hear anything, we'll be sure to pass the information along to you. Bumble. The 49ers have it. Brown by forcing the ball loose. It gets recovered right here. And they get some good yards out of it. Great turn of events for this defense. Peter, there are many ways you can start it. Okay, Dan, what we're going to look for here is whether his arm is moving forward or not. That's going to tell us if it's considered a pass. I don't know, Dan. It doesn't look like it's moving forward to me. I After agree with the original call of fumble. The passer's arm was not moving forward. Therefore, it was a fumble. Kansas City will be charged a timeout. First down, San Francisco. That will cost them a timeout. And you have to believe that he is not very happy with that call. Yeah. Let's do it. are saying he's got a torn hamstring. They're icing the injury in an effort to ease the pain forward on his return. Doubtful. Dan? Thanks, Susie. Number 10 throws a bullet to... Number 9 kicks from 39 yards out, and it's up through the goal post. Good. This drive at their own 26-yard line. Thompson takes it off the top. Tackle that to 27. Receivers and the defense is in their dime. Let's watch. Number 10 tosses it down the left sideline and it's intercepted. Dodges a tackle. No one in front of him.
Touchdown! Keep an eye on him to see if he goes out of bounds here. Watch him and watch the sidelines. Right there. He looks out to me. I think they'll overturn this one. After review, the player stepped out of bounds. First down, Kansas City. He likes the call, and you sort of have a feeling that he knew it all along. Number 15 rifles this one hard over the middle, and it's intercepted. Tackled at the 28. Clock at 23. Number nine with a 23-yarder, and they take the lead. And that'll do it for the first That's half the of this of one. The 49ers with a small lead, 9-7. to seven. And now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Boomer? First down, but no, they cannot hook up the pass. You can take a shot in that situation, and it's really not going to hurt. so far. Number 19, they... Number 31, carries it off the toss, and ends up field. Number 10, rifles it out left side, and it's caught for the score. Touchdown! 49ers. Number 10 gets this one past the secondary quite easily. I, I think the safeties were out of position on that one, Dan. Now that kind of accuracy is hard to cover, Dan. He knew where he wanted the ball. At the 31-yard line. Number 15 passes this one at number 87 catches the bullet. Number 14 catches it over the middle and is well past the markers for a first down. Number 14, nab the football away from three defenders in his area. That's got to feel good. Definitely a slow start, but he's finally got a completion. And maybe now, Pete. Number 87, grabs the fastball. Thompson gets the call on first down and gets in for the score. Boy, they get some good yardage out of this one, Dan. And they do it a number of good ways. Good line blocking, good downfield blocking. And we're set. Number seven, booms a beauty here. Number 13 decides to take it out of the end zone. The Chiefs have it. The 10, no one in front of him. And he's in for the touchdown. Darius Watts is going to keep his wits about him here and make a smart play. The ball's loose, but now he gains control. They take the lead on that touchdown, Peter, and they have to be happy with their performance on that drive. Yeah, great calls and great execution. This game is, when the score is like it is, one single mistake can change the whole. Number 15 lobs this one a bit, and it's tipped. Number 17 catches the left sideline. No good. Armstead sacks him way back at the 29. That will bring up fourth down. Jesse Armstead sends this offense backpedaling with a nice sack in the backfield. They lose some yardage there, Peter. It has to go. 11 yards to go. Number seven boots it from 46 yards out and puts it. Number seven. Nice job eliminating any forward progress on that play. That will bring up a third and long. Number 85 falls in the pass. And Number 10 uncorks this to the left sideline. Different story. 
incomplete. Not much success to be had on the right side for this passing game, Peter. They have been off. Number nine. Two yard line. Thompson gets the toss and runs into traffic. Crosses the field. Forces through. Number 87 makes on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. Number 10 rifles this one hard over the middle and it's intercepted. Tackled at the... Gets the sack and then this game. Oh, you can say that again. So far, he's got five tackles and two sacks. Hurdles... Brought down at the 46. Number 10 puts his arm into this one and... Number 87 makes the catch on the right sideline and he gets the go-ahead touchdown. Touchdown, 49ers. Number 87 almost bobbled this one away, but manages to keep possession. Way to keep your cool. That's his first touchdown. Well, that's a tough way to lose a very close game. Hey, that's part of the job of being a kicker. Goat or glory, baby. Unfortunately, this time he's the goat. And that is going to do it for this one. The 49ers come out on top 25 to 24. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying goodbye until next time. All right, Dan, thank you. So this one is in the books as we welcome you all to our ESPN Video Games post-game show. I'm Chris Berman. The 49ers stepped it up for sure, putting up some good numbers. Now let's catch up with the player who really ignited his team's offense with his death passing and has earned our Player of the Game Award. Number 10 was kind enough to give us a moment of his time, and he's on the field with Susie Calvert. Susie? Thank you, Chris. You transcended the competition today. You may have the ingredient your team needed to pull out a win here. What do you think was vital to your team's success today? Yeah, yeah, the fans are real big for us, man. They really got into the game, and we fed off their energy, man. I'm really glad we get the win for them. Back to you, Chris. That concludes our presentation of the NFL preseason on ESPN. Celebrating its 25th anniversary as the worldwide leader in sports. I'm Chris Berman. See you next time.